In January, the Department of Justice found staff members at Tutwiler Correctional Facility looked the other way for almost a decade as inmates were sexually abused. Tonight, CBS 42's Tiffany Westreet reports changes are underway to ensure the safety of the inmates. One after another. Words can't even describe the things I've seen. Former inmates began telling their stories of sexual abuse at Tutwiler Correctional Facility. And in the middle of the night, you can hear moaning and just cries. And CBS 42 began looking into those claims in 2012. In 2014, an investigation by the Department of Justice found Tutwiler had a history of unabated staff on prisoner sexual abuse and harassment. Nearly two and a half months later, Governor Bentley says they're working to correct the problem. We had recommendations of uh, 58 things that were to be put in place by our commissioner and uh, actually all 58 are being worked on at the present time. One of the changes Governor Bentley says he feels will be most noticeable are security cameras, which he says will be in place by the summer. The cameras will eliminate blind spots within the prison. Bentley also says they're working on the issue of overcrowding. There is a facility that, that we can renovate and we can probably move 200 to 300 prisoners out of Tutwiler and put them in this facility. Other changes include hiring more female corrections officers and a policy to prevent any employee accused of sexual misconduct from having contact with inmates until an investigation is complete. In Birmingham, Tiffany Westry, CBS 42 News. As part of the CBS 42 investigation, we spoke to several former inmates at Tutwiler. For those stories, go to CBS42.com.